finger body. The past time that took the world by storm. Carve it, top it, flip it. But guess what, fingerboards? Move over, because there's a new hobby in town. Handbars are real estate. Handbars do our trick. Handbars are so dandy. Handbars are really handy. I got this in the mail the other day. It took so long to get to my house. I think I ordered this around a month ago. Oh, it's getting close to a month ago, but it has finally arrived. It was sent from America and it is a handboard, but you probably already know that by the title of this video. I've never had a handboard before. I've never, I've never felt the need to get a handboard, if I'm gonna be real with you. I always thought they were just kind of awkward because you gotta use both hands and if you wanna do obstacles on them, then you're gonna have to get obstacles that are just like big. I get a ridiculous amount of comments telling me to handboard. I cracked under the pressure to get one, and I bought one. Unboxing time! We got... We got a huge sheet of grip tape. Oh, what the heck? It looks like... Nothing's put together. Wheels. Hardware. Trucks. Deck and grip tape. The board I went for is actually a pro model of another YouTuber here on the YouTube platform, YouTube. This is Sam Tabor's pro model board. You know, if I was gonna get a professional model handboard, I might as well support the YouTube brothers. I've never talked to Sam Tabor in my life, but Sam, if you're watching this, hey. <laughs> Looks like you gotta put this thing together, how you'll put a real skateboard together. It looks like a tiny skateboard truck, like you could ride these, but you probably couldn't because you're breaking. sure what's going on with the wheels, but... I don't think that's right. Alright, that's kind of as far as I could get them to go. If anyone from Redemption Fingerboards is watching this, no hate to the company, I think what you're doing is sick, but these little plastic tightening tools just really don't work. Now, I might be using them wrong, but I don't think I am, so... <laughs> Damn, I killed that grip job. There's no reason to believe in magic, uh, girl. Go ahead and let it fall. There's nothing there for you. Nothing. I've never done a handboard trick in my life. So I might really suck at this. But who knows, I might be really good. I've seen videos of Sam doing it, but I just, I don't know how I'm gonna approach this. I guess I'll try an ollie. That was almost it. I don't know what to do with this. Like, if, I don't know what kind of hand position I'm meant to do. Kick flip. First try, all right, here we go. Damn! Holy crap, I actually got that. I think one of the sick things about this, I've only done two tricks on this, but I feel like this might be easier than I think it's gonna be. Because on a fingerboard, it's really hard to independently know what each finger's gonna do. But on a handboard, if you know how to do, if you know how to do a certain trick on a real skateboard, I feel like you can do it a lot easier on this because you can decide where your hand goes a lot easier, you feel me? Let's just bang a bunch of tricks out, like... Yes. 
I can do it better. So flip for a strike. <laughs> Frontside flip, second try. Oh, that was that was nice. <laughs> Damn man. This is actually really fun. Alright, this is something I wasn't planning on doing in this video. I want to ride this thing on some kind of obstacle, but obviously all of my fingerboard ramps and stuff just aren't really to the right scale. So I have to make something that would fit this, which is actually going to be pretty big. Just something really simple like a box. I saw Sam Tabor. He made a box for his handboard, so I think I'm just gonna copy what he did and make that. And then we'll see if we can't get any tricks on this. You ever just... simple box that you could ever make. There's three pieces to it. But there's one more thing that I need to get which I don't have at the moment and that's metal edging for the sides of these. And that'll pretty much complete the box so we gotta go down to the store and see if they have some of that. To the Shatmobile! I swear these birds are out here targeting my car. <laughs> Apparently red cars attract the most bird poo. I don't know how accurate this study is, but that's what the internet's saying. <laughs> so if you got a red car, watch out because the birds are out to get you. Oh hell yeah! I just put my I just put my phone on shuffle. But tell the hater here's a slammer. I know the hate not as but mind your manners. Mitre 10, baby! Proudly locally owned. It's complete. I only put copy on one side of it because I feel like you wouldn't really ever use the other side. It's like a good size compared to a handboard. I guess we're gonna try to get some tricks on it.
Bravo Yes! That last trick, the kickflip to manual to three flip out, I spent all over, I spent so long trying to land that. And when I finally landed it, I was just like, yes. Handboarding hasn't really been how I expected it to be. It's not like fingerboarding where you can just be really mellow and just relax and do stuff. With this, like, you gotta focus. I don't, it's just something I wasn't really expecting. But then again, I didn't really know what I was expecting. But no, that was really fun. Um, if you guys wanna go check out these handboards, these are uh, redemption handboards, that they didn't send me anything. I'm just saying, if you guys wanna go check out the one that I bought. My hands have become black after using it. If you guys wanna see me do more handboarding videos, just let me know in the comments and I'll, I'll see what I can do with this thing. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to smash thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, make sure to smash thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Oh, make sure to subscribe! Sweet and cool we are It'll take five days by car